Mayor Adams today filed a $700 million lawsuit in his latest attempt to stop Texas from shipping migrants to New York. Caught in the middle of all this, thousands of children. CBS 2's Ali Bauman has more. 14 year old Kaylee came to the U.S. from Nicaragua with her family last year. I love New York City, really. Assimilating in New York as a teenage girl was almost as difficult as the 3,000 mile journey to get here. I don't really make quickly friends, so it was a little bit hard. But she's found friends in the Girl Scouts and the first ever troop solely for girls who are seeking asylum. We established this whole program to really stress that Girl Scouting brings continuity, consistency, community, and a sense of belonging. Children who have already experienced more change than most people do in their entire lives. We're trying to leave the politics outside and support uh, them in, in healing from, from what they've been through. The politics outside right now is a new lawsuit from Mayor Eric Adams against 17 bus companies, which since 2022 have been utilized by Texas Governor Greg Abbott to ship thousands of migrants to New York. These companies have violated state law by not paying the cost of caring for these migrants. The lawsuit is seeking about $700 million to cover what Adams says New York has already spent on housing and caring for the migrants that were bused here from Texas. The suit comes after Adams issued an executive order last week limiting the hours that charter buses can drop off asylum seekers in the city. Those buses since found a loophole and have been dropping migrants off at New Jersey train stations that connect to New York. Is it getting worse since the executive order? Yeah. Yeah, uh, yes, you're, what you're seeing is that families are being dropped off in the middle of nowhere in a whole other state. They have to take the subway in, the train in. Uh, and this can all be done in a, an organized, humane way if Governor Abbott would just send the buses and coordinate with us within the time frame we provided. In a statement, Governor Abbott called the lawsuit baseless, saying in part every migrant bust or flown to New York City did so voluntarily after having been authorized by the Biden administration to remain in the United States. While the politics are getting uglier outside, inside, the Girl Scouts are trying to just be kids. From Midtown, Allie Bauman, CBS2 News.